Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing well and thank you so much for spending your valuable time with me today. Now, let me just start by saying that sometimes the paintings that we had planned in our minds don't quite go the way that we intend to. And that's certainly what happened in this instance. Now, in the past, I would have been frustrated and angry and thought, oh, this has been such a waste of pain and time and effort, but I've been trying to reframe my line of thinking and try and put a more positive spin on things. So rather than looking at things like a failure, I'm trying to look at things now like a learning experience. And in this instance, I learned that the paint that I used was too thick, it had to be much thinner, and I should have mixed it for longer. I also learned that I don't enjoy acrylic pores on such a large canvas. And I probably should have tried a different pouring technique than the one that I used. So it's not a waste. And the next time I go to create a painting, hopefully it'll be much better because I'll have learned from this experience and I'll take that forward into my next painting. So I think it's important to take that sort of time out, reflect, pause, and look at your painting and if you're not happy with it by all means scrape off all the paint that's what I did and because I'm now looking at it like a learning experience I can just go in with a clear head and go right what do I want to create now the canvas is blank I can do whatever so I initially wanted to jump back into my sort of safety net of creating a seascape because I find those quite easy but I thought do you know what I've got a blank canvas here that's pretty much would have ended up in the bin so why don't I try and create this abstract painting that I've had in my head for years now probably and that's what I did so I grabbed some cardboard that was lying around I didn't have the right tools by any means but I grabbed some cardboard and started sort of sculpting the paint in, in a sort of shape that I liked and just trying to sort of get this picture out of my head onto onto canvas and it was great fun and do you know what see if I hadn't ruined that painting in the first place this painting wouldn't have happened because I've never allowed myself that sort of creative freedom and I would have been too concerned about not getting it right so I wouldn't have even bothered to start does that make sense and that's just madness so I loved painting this and I had so much fun that in future I want to create more mistakes because the more mistakes that we make, I think, the further we advance. Which maybe sounds backwards and maybe that sounds really ridiculous actually coming from me, but hey, that's my views on it. And maybe you connected with this video, maybe not, but <laughs> I'd love to know your thoughts if you can drop me a comment below and let me know your mistakes that have become paintings or you know if you've punched holes through any of your canvases in the past and I think that would be funny to hear so leave your thoughts below and if you do like this sort of content please subscribe and like the video that really means a lot to me and I'll hopefully see you again very very soon.